as we reflect on the message to the church at Sardis, I think we can start out the gate this week with talking about this idea of they have the reputation, the reputation of being alive, but they're dead. Reputation, really interesting word for the Lord to use, that they have the name of being alive. And and I this morning as I was praying for you and praying about what, what I would say here, I think that the Lord is saying to us to consider what we think and how much we think about what people think of us. How much do you think? How much do I think of what people think of me? How how uh, how much does that occupy in terms of of my thought life? How much does that that impact and influence how I carry myself at my at my job in our church in our uh, in, in the various contexts that you find yourself even in your family? How much do we care about what other people think of us? How much do you think? I want to ask you that this morning, and ask you just to. Take a little bit of time and, and consider that honestly, because it's it's incredible how much we of ourselves that we can sell off simply to please others, that we can sell off so that so they think highly of us, that we will we'll take convictions. And it's part of the reason why uh, the the sardines were not uh, sardines were not. Uh, well, the perfect example, they were the perfect example of inoffensive Christianity because they had shaved off any hard edges but for the sake of what is being seen of them rather than who they really are. And I believe that this is a word that the Lord is challenging us in, that he wants us to be in the place where we actually care about what he thinks more than we care about what other, th- other people think of us. So think about that. How much do I care about what other people think of me and why?